Since 1993, Morningstar has been the leading supplier of solar charge controllers and inverters. To understand what makes Morningstar better, let's take a quick trip through two of our most specified and respected charge controllers, the Sunsaver and the Sunsaver MPPT. Sunsavers are often called the most successful charge controllers in the solar industry. They are the world's leading solar controllers for mid-sized and smaller systems in industrial and consumer applications, and they've been proven in the most demanding applications, such as oil and gas fields, mines, and in remote systems in extreme locations ranging from mountaintops to deserts. They're built for extreme environments, and they don't just survive harsh conditions, they thrive in them. Let's see why. We'll start by judging this book by its cover. In this case, that cover is made up of extruded aluminum sections. Exactly what you want wrapped around a charge controller designed for hazardous locations and extreme conditions, from desert oil fields to remote Arctic systems. Whatever the solar charging occasion, they're dressed for it. Because they handle all the output coming from a solar array, solar charge controllers, even the most efficient ones, such as Morningstar's, can get very warm during normal operation. The one thing you don't want building up in a solar charge controller is heat, because heat shortens the life of the components inside, which hurts reliability, and it's wasted energy that impairs system efficiency. So notice what you don't see anywhere on a Sunsaver or any other Morningstar, an opening for a fan, because we don't need them. This is a good thing. Fans break, suck in dust and dirt, shorten component life, and are a parasitic load. The Sunsaver MPPT heatsink is built like a miniature engine block with a cast aluminum heatsink for maximum cooling efficiency. We use that material because it can be molded for the best mechanical structure for heat management. See those rectangular wells between the fins? That's how we get the heatsink right next to the circuitry behind it for optimal heat transfer. It ensures there's less distance for the heat to travel. On the outside of the Sunsaver PWM, you'll see a lot of fine print. And you want to pay attention to that because you aren't going to see it on many other solar charging components. You see, where solar electricity is needed and safety is mandatory, Sunsaver is standard equipment. And that covers a lot of solar in places such as gas and oil fields. Sunsaver PWM comes with a Class 1 Division 2 Groups A through D approval for use in hazardous locations. That includes places where chemicals such as gasoline, hydrogen, acetylene, propane, benzene, methane, and other gases, vapors, and liquids might exist in an explosive concentration. That's why we don't bother with cliches such as safe and dependable when talking about the Sunsaver. We kind of wrote the book on that. And that T5 designation? It refers to temperature classification, specifically the maximum product surface temperature that could possibly occur under operation. In this case, T5 equals 100 degrees Celsius or 212 degrees Fahrenheit. That's the temperature of boiling water. That's how tough a Sunsaver is. Once you get under the hood of a Sunsaver PWM, you're going to see, well, not much really. That's because its tough, conformally coated circuit board is sheathed in an equally tough epoxy encapsulation material. It's also not just ordinary epoxy, like the cheap stuff used for transformers and such. Instead, we use a unique premium formula for high thermal conductivity and low electrical conduction. So while the insides may look a little boring, it's actually a marvel of extreme environmental engineering. But what else would you expect from something designed to operate in conditions that could melt a lesser charge controller? In the MPPT version, the internal build quality is on display, where advanced heat management is top priority and where we put in a lot of innovations. One of them is selecting capacitors and other components rated to withstand temperatures higher than boiling water and high torque corrosion resistant terminals. Another innovation is the higher grade of copper pour in our printed circuit boards. These overspec components cost more, but we're engineering for extreme reliability instead of a bottom line. We maximize the potential of our overspec components with advanced electronic engineering and software design. Combined with our premium components, this improves control response. Actually, with our advanced electronics engineering, 
We could take a shortcut to better performance simply by settling for components as good as the ones found in our competitors' products. But by using better ones, we set a higher standard for the entire industry. And that's another reason why Sunsavers are standard in extreme applications. Also, Morningstar's acclaimed TrackStar technology on the MPPT version ensures the highest output possible from the solar array. In the MPPT version, that digital edge continues with high-quality processors on board, performing a wide range of critical tasks. Finally, we ensure long-term reliability with advanced protection features. Our extensive electronic protection network guards against reverse polarity, short circuits, and overcurrent conditions, as well as excessive heat buildup. And a built-in transient voltage surge protector guards against worst-case electrical hazards. And we make sure the charge controller can talk solar with any system or network using standard industry language. In the MPPT version, R speaks Modbus and SNMP for system monitoring and cloud connectivity when used with the optional Morningstar EMC1. In the information area, the self-diagnostics monitor and analyze system performance so there are no surprises, very important in protecting expensive batteries. And we back all this up with a five-year warranty. For the record, that's two and a half times longer than many of our competitors. Morningstar's obsession with quality and reliability is why we have the lowest published failure rate in the industry, under a half percent, and why we've sold over four million Morningstars since 1993 for use in some of the most mission-critical solar applications on the planet. And this is why Morningstar is considered the charging experts in solar technology and has been for over a quarter century.